Lisa, we just living life. We just living life with Lisa, Lisa. Hey, it's nice to meet ya. We just living life with Lisa, Lisa. We just living life. With Make sure you subscribe. Like reviews, yeah. Hey, it's about to go down. Have a good time. All you gotta do, yeah, is scroll on down and click that button if you wanna see more. Hello everyone and welcome back to Living Life with Lisa Lisa. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So today guys, I received a message on Instagram and it read as this. Have you seen my Thanksgiving series? Get into it, let's make it a Friendsgiving. Someone reminded me today that we were supposed to be doing that. So join the wave, my people. Post your favorite best bomb Thanksgiving dish and hashtag it, hashtag Friendsgivings, hashtag Thanksgiving series, ready, set, go. Can't wait to see your dish. And this was from none other than Mukbang and Things. So yes, y'all jump on board with this Friendsgiving recipe. Post your recipe and don't forget to um, hashtag Friendsgiving and hashtag Thanksgiving series. So guys, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be doing a turkey dressing, okay? And this is my way. Doesn't mean that you have to make it this way. This is just my way that works for me and my family. And I enjoy making it and I'm enjoying sharing it with you guys. So all right, you all stay tuned. All right guys, so we're starting off with our empty bowl here. And we're going to start this recipe off with the cornbread stuffing mix. We're gonna go ahead and just pour it in the bowl. And then I made some cornbread and that's what you see there. I crum crumbled it up a little bit. So now I'm adding it to the cornbread stuffing mix. Crumble, crumble, crumble. So now I'm going to add my shredded turkey. I boiled my turkey legs and um, once they cooled, I shredded them. So that's what you see me adding to the mix. So now we have three ingredients. We have the, um, the stuffing mix, we have the baked cornbread, and we have the shredded turkey. As you can see, I'm trying to show you guys here what we have and what it looks like. So now we're going to add some of that good old chicken broth. And the chicken broth is gonna break up some of that cornbread and stuffing mix to thin it out some. Now we wanna add some seasonal. And you guys, um, you can use the seasoning according to your taste. What you think is best for you. Now I'm going to add, okay, focus, focus now. Focus, focus. I'm going to add a little bit of minced garlic. I'm only going to add a little bit. It doesn't take a lot. And now my favorite, black pepper. Adding me some black pepper to my taste. And next, I have some garlic powder. We're gonna add that garlic powder all up in this mixture, y'all. And then we want to add some paprika. And again, just add the seasoning according to your taste, the amount. And you don't have to use these seasonings that I'm using, you can use your own seasoning. And now we have that complete seasoning, sazon complete. So 
so yeah if you want to use other seasonings you can you know this is just the way I do it and then I add some parsley flakes in there as well too and I'm gonna add some more when I'm when I'm done and now mm, 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 y'all I'm adding my cream of chicken soup cream of chicken now sometimes I add cream of mushroom as well too but this time I chose not to use the cream of mushroom I just use the cream of chicken so now I'm showing you my hands they're clean and I'm getting ready to dig in to mix this all up get it all blended together and my hands are clean y'all and I know I don't have gloves on but um it's just me and my family eating it and um like I said my hands are clean I wash my hands and I'm mixing it all up together I am getting it in honey I'm mixing that turkey in with that cream of chicken with that stuffing mix and that cornbread mix and getting all them seasonings all mixed up in there y'all yes so I'm going over again, y'all. I'm washing my hands. I'm washing my hands. Happy Friendsgiving to everyone. So as y'all can see, I just placed some um, more chicken broth on the counter because I'm going to need some more. So I'm going to pour some more into my measuring cup so I can add it to the mixture to thin it out some more. And sometimes I use the broth from the um I use the broth from the turkey. So here I am adding more chicken broth because we need it more. So now I'm still blending and blending and blending with my hands yes y'all I'm blending it all in together I want everything blended get all of that broth mixed up in that bread whoop there's my one egg let's drop that egg in there and now we have to mix that egg up in that mixture yes as you can see my hands as they're stroking it's gotten a little bit easier so that broth has thinned that um, bread and that stuffing mix and the turkey the shredded turkey together so yes we are ready and guess what guys I'm going to wash my hands again So now y'all, let's get ready. Let's get ready to get our glass Pyrex dish. So we can pour this greatness on in. There's my Pyrex dish. And I have some olive oil spray. I like to spray the pan before I put my um, dressing in the pan and so now that it is all sprayed we're going to add our dressing in the pan and as you guys saw I did at the end add a little bit more of broth and you saw that come out first 
don't worry don't think it's gonna be soupy because i promise you it is not gonna be soupy it is going to be good it's not going to be dry at all but you guys will see and if you guys did not check out the um friends giving one big happy family collab that we did on tuesday guys go and check it out i believe there were about 15 channels that participated in this collab and you guys oh my gosh there was some good food going on over there so y'all go check that out so now i have the dressing in my pyrex dish i'm probably looking for a spoon so I could go ahead and even this out in the pan all the way around. So just hold tight, y'all. Let me get a spoon. spoon and we're spreading it out throughout our, our pyrex dish and it's going to be ready to go into the oven and remember I told y'all I would be using the parsley flakes again here we go, I'm using it at the end, right before placing it in the oven. There you go. So in the oven it goes, guys. Looky, looky, that is my turkey dressing. Lisa, Lisa, hey, it's nice to